Hello! A quick video today on how to use SmartLink to write to a file, for example, a text file. So we'll see in that video how to set up the SmartLink to do so. First, of course, we're going to need the SmartLink. So let's check. Yes, we are SmartLink and it's online. Good. Secondly, we're going to have to set up the smart link with some change we need to make on the smart link. So we go devices smart link, we go in smart link, and here on smart link network connection, we're going to set that to message and command. Uh, we have to add a task here, but we didn't create it yet. We could just make a right click here and say new. That will go directly to the task new and set up file. But just to make sure we are on the same page, let's go definition task builder. We're going to say new, right? And then we're going to give the name. Startup tag six. All right, I'm entering the code. Let me put it here for you so you can see what I'm writing here. All right, the dollar sign R six dollar sign R. The six can be changed to a different number if we want to. Okay, so now I save. Then I can go back to my smart link and finish the setting. Smart link. What I was missing is to add the task. Here we go. Smart link is ready. Then I'm going to create the task. Even output if we want to. All right, task builder, new, write to a file. Before everything, I'm going to work on the location. I'm going to have my file add it in my folder called macro contact in my case but that can be any folder all right all right so let's do it so i go those of course i go on the drive and i select all right and then here let's say an example sample that txt that's it. And here is writing the necessary code for me. Enter, I go next. Now what do I want here? Um, I want to have, every time I have access granted, someone access the system, and I want the name and his card number added to a file. So, eh, not a big deal. I'm going to say card username. You know what? Let me start by card number first. I want card number. Uh, let me do a space. All right, and then I want card username. After that, I want to go to the next line. So I could add any other stuff, but for now, that's what I need. Okay, so pretty much we're pretty much done. After that, I need save. I put it twice. Sorry. Save. And then, as you can see here, file close. I wanted to close the file. That's it. I have my task with it. Of course, I could add anything else like 
the date, the time, you know. You know, in fact, let's add the date. So it'll be good to know. So we were here just before the space. Not the space, the... Go into the line. Let's add... Date. Okay. Good. Now what we have left. Now it's since we have everything ready. We need the trigger. What's gonna trigger this? We're gonna go new. We said access granted. Oh, oh. let me write that better. Okay, access granted as type that's gonna be a door. That can be all the door, or group of door, or single door. I, I'm going to go with a specific door. That's going to be the reception door. Always need a schedule. Select the smart link. And my task. Write to a file. Of course, I need the event. In that case, it's going to be access granted. Okay. So pretty much we need to test, but first, of course, we need cards. Let's make sure we make some cards. Access granted entrenamiento. Yep, we have a card. But of course, it's not at the correct door. But we, sh we have a card. Let me try another one. Access design. Another one. Access going to okay, so we have two cards ready now. Clean up message screen. Now let's check our folder. Nothing is there. So we move the folder so we can have a look together. Okay, we did. I'm gonna swipe. Access granted. Here we go, and I have my file. I open it and I see the card number, the name of the user, and the date. Now, I had another card. I swipe. And then I open the file and I have the second user. Card number, name, date. As I <laughs> request the file and in that file as you can see you can add anything you want all right i hope these help you to see one of the programming use one of the use for your smart link there is a lot of thing you can do with your smart link thank you very much